see any like you know invading quick attacks that we're used to seeing these Pikachu's do. Mm -hmm. That's going to get snuffed out. But let's get right into it. The action is yep. starting, coming starting to you hot. This the uh, Sulk versus Pikachu action. We yes. really starting off with these back air trains. Never mind, Solar he's bad. Stream. Let's go. I, I thought we were gonna immediately see like you know a back air train. Here we go again. Is he gonna actually get it? Yes, he is. Little shield art there. So goes different colors, and all of a sudden he cannot be comboed. It is a beautiful stuff. But there we go. Um, I feel like like a lot of the moves that like Solar wants to like poke away is like. We're not going to be seeing a lot of back airs hit because Pikachu is so damn small. Absolutely. He's going to be focusing on this uh, this snare and the, the forward air. When he goes for back air, he's going to have to time it very well low to the ground. Oh, Jesus Christ. This is actually looking like very rough to start oh, out with. Got to get into that jump. Really tough. Deekstream not opting to go out there. Opting to shoot for a, a downer at ledge instead. Yeah. So about what I was saying, saying earlier about, like, you know, so be, being able to stop Pikachu from invading, that's going to be rough if, like, I, I did not. I did not put a uh, T jolt in that equation at it's all. True. G Extreme gonna be prioritizing throwing a few T jolts out to aid his uh, his approach. Absolutely, whenever he can. And he would figure like Solar to try to get a lot of money, a lot of his like bread on the ledge, but G Extreme not getting himself to ledge trap at all. Yeah. He's able I mean, to just sneak by. We see Solar in a set against Jay, and just typically he'll get a lot of his mileage off of ledge and set up a lot of ledge trap situations. But Pikachu, known as a character who can easily get around that. Indeed. So how will Soul Arts, how will he play this? And it's like it's something too because it's something I know about Soul Arts. He plays very, he plays very slow. He he like paces himself very I'll throw well. Enough. Yeah, barely enough. Um, Soul Arts paces himself very well. So against a character like Pikachu who forces you to play his game most of the time, it's it's, it's so hard. I don't think Soul Arts can play at the pace he likes. Yeah, he's usually a tempo controller, but I think especially now at this deficit. Stock down, it's gonna be tough. Oh my god, all these hitboxes coming around. G Extreme managing to get out of the ledge safely. Oh, Smash Art just runs out before that back air. Yeah, and Solar's seeing him trying to time these back airs perfectly, but half the time they won't even come out. He'll land it too low. That's always been a tricky thing with Soul. Absolutely. After reason I do not like playing this matchup at all. If I if I see Pikachu, I'm just nair dancing my way across over. Don't like it at all. We're gonna see a back to the oh. ledge. Nice air to hush. Trenko reminiscent there, pulling the, trigger, <laughs> pulling the trigger on any thunder. Oh my god, I saw I saw um, Trenko versus a summit sun. He managed to like murder him, yes. like just drag his ass I'm down. I'm loving the confidence here from all these Pikachu's. Oh yeah, I've man. That move out there. They're realizing that the character's broken. Just, they're just now realizing they're it, apparently. Just now realizing. <laughs> Took them this long. Swords. Okay, okay. There so we go. Okay. D Extreme trying to stall out. It looked like the uh, the arts, but I think jump art. Not, not exactly the art you want to stall out mm. off stage like that. Not at all. He has so much range. Like his burst range with jump art is absolutely massive. Can't be out there. Can't yes. be just hanging out outside there. No free reign. And there we go. GXU shooting to stay away from him. Doesn't want to deal with the purple man at all. Ooh, cannot punish that with an up smash. Absolutely not. Hide the nair coming out. There we go. Swords able to get some damage Ooh, off. Swords moving around now. Back. Controlling the center stage. My man is moving and grooving. There we go. It's Oh, good parry. Whatever. Parry on the rising aerial to make it very punishable. Ooh, that is smart. And with a, a massive hitbox like Soap there, yeah, that's going to be easy, easy money for there. Uh, GXG has to be careful how he's going to oh. land. Ooh, get kind of the classic landing option there. A little bit of a panic. Hold in the center stage, fastball, neutral air dodge. I feel like GXG was definitely ready for a. He was ready for an up tilt, which I'm not going to lie, I was too. That switch was immaculate. Yes. <laughs> the reaction there covered himself. Okay, now here we go. Solar's not really having a need. He can't switch there because he has no shield. Ooh, very rough, very rough, very Interesting. Rough. He didn't opt for it. He opted for a different kind of punish on a, a Pikachu dash attack on shield, even though G-Extreme would go for the, the common spot dodge after to avoid getting shield grab. But Solar's punish was not enough. Nice. G-Extreme's parries are kind of on point today. Oh, yeah. Oh, that landing hitbox. Don't get fooled. Landing hitboxes are bait of this are bait. They are. They should be removed. Absolutely gone. They yeah, still it, need to exist. It's proving very difficult for uh, for Solar to get any kind of out of shield option yeah, to land to, on Pikachu. G Extreme like, doing a great job mixing it up. Absolutely. He's, he wants to like narrow out of shield sometimes, or maybe even like up up the out of shield. Up the out of shield mm -hmm. is huge, but it's such a huge. There it right is. There. <laughs> we see it. We see it. Speak it into existence. Why don't I? He it's loves pulling the trigger on that, but yeah. Oh, wait. As soon as he got off stage, I knew GX Stream was like shocking practice. He doesn't yes. want to play Neutral versus Shulk anymore. And unlike in uh, in his set versus Jay, in these games, I feel Solars has to be much more careful with those air dodges to ledge. Mm -hmm. We know he doesn't want to go low and have to commit to an upbeat. It's you know not really. It's hard to sweet spot the ledge from down there. He's he's putting himself in a, a very risky position. But 
these air dodges are just as telegraphed in a way. Yeah, man. Or it's like they're just easy to react to. Pikachu goes off of so many ways to just make recovering a living hell yeah. for Shulk. Running it back straight to the stage, so I'm wondering what Soul Arts learned from the first game. Cause that's something this man does a lot. He yeah, just I mean, makes you adapt pretty quickly. The neutral quickly. was pretty. It was pretty back and forth. I don't think any player had a a great read yet on how the other is uh, is trying to play this. But I think the extreme took the stock where it mattered. Yeah, definitely did. That, that down arm was definitely sending a message. Oh, say get out of my airspace, man. I'm the captain. Don't, don't approach here, but not GXP. Yeah, 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 man. Here we go. Here not we go. want to approach the purple man. <laughs> Look at that one there did like 18%. That's He's vile. making sure any hit Solar Arts gets is just stray. Just a little bit of damage. Does not want to get opened up up close. Not at all. It's very, it's oh, very trips rough. back, mates out that up B. It's tough for Solar Arts to react. It really is. Oh, no. This is scary. He can explode. Okay, never mind. Solar Arts not choosing to commit Howie oh, Robbery. He had today. the jump read there. G Extreme. Playing a lot better off stage here, really threatening Solars. It is, but now Solars is actually punishing these uh, these low C jolts very much. Like seeing oh. it, and now finally G Extreme actually hitting That's that. He's been looking for that all day. Yes. Pongo said he was not hitting that at all. It took time, you know. He's here now. You know, he's played oh. enough. He's played enough sets. Oh Jesus! Oh, the switch. There was a lot Very of lights going around. Honestly, I'm surprised G Extreme got out of that unscathed. Yeah, I speak way too him. soon. Catches him dashing it from the corner. He cannot pull up the shield right there, so he's exploding for that. A lot of Shulk's arrows that like can lead him to the big damage are super committal. Yeah, that's why he. Oh, okay, he's fine. Uh, Soul Arts and you know Shulk in general love to throw on that speed art to make their their combo starters much more safe and. Uh, and to, you know, to put the pressure on, for sure. Absolutely. See, oh, I, call, I used to call speed art, I mean, it still is. I call speed art the bread-winning art. Yeah, that's the one you're winning neutralist. You're putting yes. on the most pressure with that one. Absolutely. Oh, no tech. Oh, Surprising. Fly. He spent a lot of time in the air. Oh, get sucked in. Nice job. G Extreme doing a great job here off stage. I think that is where Solar has to be very careful. Yeah, man. Can't be jumping too early. Can't be just, you got you to be careful. You got to mix up your recovery option every single time. Absolutely. Gets the shield grab that time. Here we go. Back throw on him. Are we going to go deep for it? No, he's just going to stall it out as much as possible. Very nice. Oh, oh no. and again, it's really just, it's not working out. These uppies out of shield, the timing on him, he's committing in the wrong spots. There, I think he tried to do it again right there. That would actually work on the, uh, on the back air. Yeah. Pikachu, very strong shield pressure. There we go. Catch him at the ante, very good. And oh. a reversal. A reversal there. Drifts in with that forwarder. I see Solars making it happen. Yeah. And if there's one thing, Solars has not been racking up a ton of damage. He's been taking his stocks at good percents to keep these games close. But we need to see him living longer then and winning these neutral interactions. Making use of the raids that he gets onto him. So he's just steal these stocks. He has to, I, I hate to say it like this, but he has to, he has to look for the cheese. Absolutely. Like you have to, you have to go for it. Pikachu this, is he's cheesable. Yeah, super cheesable, super light. Oh, I and say that's you're it. a monster. And no. You're a monster. He, Solaris does love to go for that up smash. He does, but maybe a little early there. Yeah, uh, it's like I feel like if he G extreme neutral got up there, uh, that was it. That oh, was, that, that was, was it. Game. He doesn't <laughs> miss those. He doesn't, he doesn't miss those. Mm. I've seen him hit it at least ten times just today. Jesus Christ. But G extreme. I don't know. I haven't been seeing a ton of neutral getup from him, so I'm not sure if that was exactly 100% called for from Solars. Right? It might have been more of a kind of desperation, yes. wanting that early stack, just like we were talking about. Yeah. So let's see if uh, maybe this game three against Solars can bring something different to the table, or just like maybe figure something out, catch something on, on the extreme defensive options. Yeah. Solars does not like switching stage. He definitely is not a counter picker in that way. He likes to readjust his style rather than try to work the same style on a different stage. Yeah. It's like. Running it back here is like another way of just saying, I can do this. Yes. So he's definitely feeling himself, uh, feeling that he can definitely do this. But right now he's definitely oh, getting ran over down here. by Pikachu, the rat. He said, welcome to New York City, my dude. Let me see how we do it here. <laughs> okay, there we go. Buster actually able to get some damage off. Pretty even right now. Very good, very good. And gets out of shield that time. He, he holds shield, 
Stay strong until that landing hitbox is over. Able to read the roll. I want to see him like at least punish like these rolls. Like a oh no! Dive. Okay, that was smart field. Smart field. I don't know if uh, down smash was the best option there from G Extreme, knowing that any multi hit like that can be shield art out of. I think he was just like looking for the damage and also like. You know, I think he forgets. Because Pikachu players are going like. It's very possible. Oh, oh no, no! He overshot. He undershot. Tragic. What the oh, hell? Oh, he was about to. And Geek Stream stalling the right amount. He knows perfectly how to stall that. So he knows how to play against Sorg. He just doesn't know what like to do when, uh, yeah. when Shield Art's on the table. And I feel that PS2 does give Pikachu that wall and that little area underneath the stage to stall. Definitely not uh, not beneficial for Soul Arts there. Not at all, man. He needs to find a way to just snatch these stocks. He's letting Pikachu run around him way Ooh, too much. Are you shitting me? Yeah, yeah going back. But no legend ability. Oh, he doubles no up. Punish. Yes. Oh, my God. And he still that, makes it back from that all is that? very sad. Solarts was fine taking that damage, knowing that he would get that free downer, but the game said no. Uh, and I saw this reaching a bit, a bit too much right now. Yeah, and G-Extreme taking advantage of this hard. That Solarts oh, paying the rent at the ledge right now, man. Oh, sends him down with that. Oh, no. It's looking really rough. Solar's lacking arts, and yes, perfect. That is such an easy edge guard for him. Then the down to yeah, it. Straight away, straight away. Still, though, G-Extreme with this, this stock lead, huge props to him for taking advantage of that that uh, that ledge situation and really turning it turning Solar's uh, desperation into a huge opening. Indeed, speaking of few opening right now, Solar's oh. getting a read on that roll, managing to rack up this damage. Yes. Can he move? He is not out of this game yet. Where there's an art, there's a way. Oh, we're looking for these rolls in. I love it. Oh, my no, oh it doesn't get anything off the smash art and misses the out of shield. Doesn't turn it around, but he air dodges right in with the shield art. Oh, very good, good. nice. Very nice counter. Now he lacks the shield art. Hello? That wasn't true? I've never seen a Pikachu move drop like that. Able to get the back air punish. Smash Art is back on the table. But the Extreme actually choosing to like go in a little bit. Yeah, oh, he's playing so well around this. Giving him the appropriate honor. Oh, oh, that oh, doesn't no. kill. Not it. Speed Art not helping out there. Yeah, that one casting it together easy. And he is just making it, this, making recovering just a living hell for so much. Unable to land. Even unable to like punish, yes. making it very hard to hit this rat. It's looking really rough. I mean, we haven't. Okay, okay. You know, like I said, where does hold it, hold. Where does an art? There's a way. <laughs> Soul arts. He does have the arts. He is moving and grooving, and G Extreme just not landing at all. Doesn't need oh, to. Gets his grab. I had 34 percent. Oh, he's got to be careful in the corner here. He recover smartly. Just to get up is not the play. As someone who's been scouting that out all game, I would not be wanting to do to get up. Well, I guess I'm going back here. G-Stream looking a little, a little desperate here. Little, Wants yeah. this game over. Un very like, understandable. Oh, God, I think he's a little bit scared. Because, you know, Soak with all this rage coming up. One oh. well-placed attack. One well-placed read with Smash. Oh, he had the read, but then Soak oh, back here is a bit finicky. His this is not good. Oh, look for the jump read. This, can, this is anyone's game right now. Oh, this is very scary. Will G Extreme pull the trigger on a dash attack? And he no. does! That's it! He lands that last hit of the Pikachu forward air. Jesus Christ. On the smash arm, more than enough. Soul Arts, huge respect for that uh, 